The marbled godwit has one of the longest beaks among shorebirds compared to its body size. Its beak can reach up to five inches long, nearly one third of its entire body length. This long beak isn't just for appearance, it serves an important purpose. It helps the bird find food buried deep in mud and sand. Marbled godwits eat worms, mollusks, and small crustaceans hidden beneath the surface. A longer beak means the bird can reach more food, which is especially important during migration when they need a lot of energy quickly. Besides its impressive length, the godwit's beak is sensitive and flexible. It contains many nerve endings, allowing the bird to feel the movement of prey underground. This sensitivity helps the bird accurately find food even when it can't see it. Marbled godwits migrate long distances each year, flying more than 2,000 miles without stopping. The protein-packed food they find using their long beaks provides essential energy to sustain them during these long flights. This helps them stay strong and healthy throughout their migration. Each year, marbled godwits travel between their breeding grounds in the northern Great Plains of the United States and Canada and their winter homes along coastal regions, including Florida. They usually arrive in late summer or early fall and stay until spring. The length of a godwit's beak can also affect its social interactions and mating success. Birds with longer beaks are typically seen as better providers because they can find more food. This can make them more successful in attracting mates and raising healthy chicks. While the marbled godwit's long beak may seem strange, it is perfectly adapted to help the bird survive. It allows the godwit to reach food others can't, successfully complete long migrations, and improve its chances of raising healthy offspring. And that's the birdness of it all. If you enjoyed learning about this fascinating bird, check out this other video we recommend.